Here's the lineup for Humble Lion. Shamal Briscoe in goal. They have a back for Fabian Pasco, Mark Rodney, Malik Robinson, and Zidane Christie. Andrew Vanzi, Romari Harris, Jordan Williams, Javon Smith, Phil Clark, Rasheen Sharp, the players uh, who lead the forward line. Russell Reynolds, uh, the head coach. Here's a formation. The lineup has a 4 2 3 1. Vanzi, Williams, and Harris there into the midfield and Sharp, the out and out striker, Clear Clark, and Brian, the men who have the task of providing width. Here's the lineup for Cavalier, J.D. White in goal, Giovanni Ling, Kyle Ling, Gadeel Irving, Richard King, that back four is solid. Christopher Ainsworth, Ronaldo Barrett, Dwayne Atkinson, Shamar Watson, Shanil Thomas, and Jalmaro Calvin, the man from Antigua and Barbuda. Six goals this season. They're coached by Rudolph Speed. Yep, 4 3 3 is what they'll work with. Dwayne Atkinson shaking off that injury where he came off just at the start of the second half in the last game, playing out wide with Ainsworth as well. And Atkinson, the player to watch. Chanel Thomas was slotting in the attacking midfield role, one that he has enjoyed but not played often. There's a Gossum, got things going. And Cavalier, they show their intention there. Chanel Thomas turning well and firing directly to Briscoe. They would continue. First goal. Beautiful pass from Christopher Ainsworth to Gary Irving, the captain, and what a strike it was in the seventh minute of play. The sports max that moment of the game. What a finish. Briscoe beaten for pace. Left in bewilderment. They'd continue. And Atkinson. Love the ball across, Janil Thomas, right on hand to slot it home. That was in the 20th minute of the game. An assist for Atkinson and five goals this season for Janil Thomas. Showing his quality in front of goal. Vanzi tested, Jalen White. And no player from Humble Lion was uh, ready on hand to really slot home the advantage that they would have received from the Rebound. Brian doing good work, getting by, getting the shot off. Took a deflection from King. Gary Irving played, played it into his own goal. Jaden White could do nothing about that, and there was a difficulty for Jaden White. All ends out. Perhaps against the run of play, that goal was scored. And in the second, in the first half again, another great opportunity for Humble Lion. Clear Clark getting on the end of that header, unable to bring it on target. It was, certainly would have beaten Jaden White. Had a shot in the second half that Clear Clark, wide of the mark. Cavalier getting the, that shot. Roshane Sharp getting the block. Reed also testing the keeper, Briscoe. Had to make a save there in the dying moments of this encounter. And that was uh, that for this encounter. Cavalier getting the win. Here, the full-time statistics. Only one shot on target from five attempts for Humble Lion. Seven from eight. Great accuracy. Week on week for Cavalier. 22 fouls of split even. Two yellow cards show to Humble Lion. One for Cavalier. Three offsides they had. They could have done better in watching the line. Five corners to Humble Lion's two. Five saves made by Briscoe, only one made by Jaden White. And uh, possession kind of leveled out in the second half, 53 to 47. But Cavalier with all the marbles, 2 1. Chanel, for a long period, even last season, you were struggling in terms of finding goals. Now you have five goals in this season. How happy are you about your performance and your goals that you set for this season? Um, I'm happy about the performance. I must thank my teammates for providing me with the goals that I've been scoring. Um, I'm being consistent and I like that. 
You've never minded being in the provider as well. Um, talk to me about your new position. Today you were asked to play an attacking midfield role instead of striker. Do you, did you enjoy it? Um, yeah, I've been, I've been playing that for numerous games in and out. So I'm, I'm elated with, when I'm playing that position. I'm very happy I can see the game and I can assist or I can score. And obviously when your confidence is high as well, as you said, not only the goals but the ability to pick out teammates has been a strength of your game since you're a schoolboy. Yeah. Um, it, it seems like something you really enjoy, assisting as well. Yeah, I really enjoy assisting. I mean, it's not a one-man game. Um, I have a lot of attacking players with quality. So when I get a chance to provide them with a goal-scoring opportunity, I will do that. And they will do the same for me. When you see other players coming back into the squad, like Dwayne Atkinson, obviously you have a good chemistry with him. You've been playing for a while for yeah. Cavalier. What do you think are Cavalier's chances in terms of going all the way this season, especially with the options that you have? Um, huge, huge, huge. Um, I think we can take it further. Um, three trophies eluded us. And with the players, um, Dwayne Atkinson and King coming back into the team, I think we will we'll come out victors at the end of the season. All right, Shanil, good to see you playing with a smile on your face. Congratulations on your goal so far. Keep scoring, and we'll see you in the weeks to come. Thank you, I will do so. Shanil Thomas there.